Yokoso. The sensei has been expecting you. We invite you to sit under the learning tree of a multiple time siege winner. This is the dojo of M4. Now we do three part harmony. I'm up for it. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's let's start this stream now that it's 8:48. <laughs> 15 minutes in, we're finally <laughs> going to see something. All right. So let's see if I can <laughs> re-roll the intro. <laughs> okay, I've uh, I've gone to the blog post to read the kits because I think that might be an important thing to do before being on this stream. Uh, and apparently Blackfire is immune to critic damage, so anyone planning on writing a review, uh, your words will bounce right off her. Be wary. Yes, we're, we're not allowed to insult her at all, uh, which is fine. I'm fine with that. Who are we not in allowed to ins insult? Blackfire is immune to critic damage. Oh yeah. So all right, I did check that. Uh, it's only in the announcement. I think here we're still allowed to. Yeah, she is only immune to critical damage, not yeah. critic damage. Critical damage. That's so. Dis that's disappointing. That's disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I think that's fine actually as a passive because that's like man bat, right? Yes, it yeah, is she'll be like... fine. Yeah, I just I prefer them to have yeah. typos. Oh right, right. <laughs> it it makes me feel like there's humans on the other side of everything. <laughs> there isn't. <laughs> it's a cold dead void. <laughs> All right, so I have not played a whole lot of Starfire, but you can fix that. I am high on Terra. So let's let's look at Terra first. Alright. Uh, but first thanks thanks for joining me today and dealing with the technical difficulties. And we also have a surprise guest that even I got surprised but most welcome, SPO. So hopefully you don't get to trash anyone today, because I believe both three works are decent, if not good. All right, so let's look at there. Oh, you're right, Mr. Zubast. I do kind of blend in. <coughs> if you don't know where to look, you're probably going to miss me. But that's kind of always true. Uh, <laughs> listen, no, no, nobody tunes in for the video. Okay? Uh, Wait, nobody can hear SPO? Um, no, I've just been quiet. You should be able to hear me. Yeah, you should be. If you can hear Zubas, you should be able to hear SPO. Yeah, okay. All right, perfect. Yeah, believe it or not, on occasion, I do shut my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> all right so i hope you guys remember his uh their old kits because i have not used them a whole lot so i uh, my memory might be fuzzy i know they're old kits i because i use them a ton check the DCL toolkit right now to see if they've been updated i expect they haven't they have Quick. been uncanny was all over it jeez dude all right. Ooh, Darren is a very... is? No, I don't exist. I wasn't here. SPO is one of the... Will I say... Should I say famous? I, um, I mean, uh, people know you, so I guess I can call you famous. Uh, Arkham Streamers? Yes, he is. <laughs> and has a very... What, how would you describe your humor? I'm the resident shithead. That's all you need British? to know. <laughs> British. British. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So there you go. There, there goes SPO's uh, introduction. British humor. There you go. That's all you need to know. Batman fan, British humor. There you go. SPO in a nutshell. 
All right, so going to Tara's kit. Uh, the previous kit, she had three evasion downs. And, and 70%, her, uh, right? Her, her heal immunity was only 70%. Right. So big upgrade. The guaranteed yeah, heal immunity and the uh, extra evasion is enough to handle Harley, uh, not under Batgirl. That alone. Now, M4, I, I do have a question for you. Sure. And I, I think we've tested this and I can't remember. Is one evasion down equal as like the opposite to one evasion up? I am almost certain it is. Okay. I am almost certain. If if it's not that the concept of that hurts my brain so much that I reject <laughs> it, even if it's empirically true. All right, so this is driving me nuts. So everyone else cannot hear the echo except for one person, and that person is me. So I'm gonna go wired. So give me a second. Do you I just... have Do you have the stream muted? <laughs> Uh, Do you have your in stream open? God dang it. Is that it? No, I don't even have Twitch out. I think I'm hearing it from, ah. my, uh, from my Mac speakers and my AirPods. So I'm going to switch off the AirPods and hope I don't break anything. Just okay. give me a second. I'm going to check something. All right. So they can't hear me, but you guys still can. So give me a second. All right. Be right back. You have like morals and stuff. Eventually, <laughs> we just threw that out the window because he didn't yeah. care anymore. Now he is. Uh, now he is like DC canon as a uh, pedophile rapist. So, um, yeah, that's that's pleasant. Um, but uh, he got a rework recently, and Tara got a rework recently. In twenty twenty. Yeah. Uh, I, I have to say, um, there is something, I'm looking at the kits, there's something really darkly funny about the fact that the first character to have silence immunity as, like, a buff in about two years is the first, like, canonically new character they've introduced. I don't know whose idea of a sick joke this was. Yes, I, I mentioned that uh, as one of my comments in that exact Reddit post is <laughs> me saying that it's, like, supremely weird uh, that he has really uh, silence immunity or the meat. So that's fun. All right, I'm going to wrestle back control of my stream. I hope you can hear me. <laughs> Yes, we can hear you. And all right. All right, here we go. I think I got things almost figured out. Uh, all right. So we were talking well, about her. Uh, I'm, don't mind me, I'm just gearing up Tara as we speak. <laughs> <laughs> That's a smart move. Perfect. Super good. Thank you for the confirmation. She's going to be very useful. She yeah, I've I've been on the terror train for a very long time. Yes. I know how people are back. She... And now there's good reason to. <laughs> That's right. Uh... There was a time a while back when I wanted to gear her as an answer to Harley for the female blitz. Uh, but then I realized that she doesn't do that. <laughs> right. <laughs> so I stopped gearing her. She kind of does, but not well enough. <laughs> but 
maybe that will change now. It, I think it would change. I've been seeing, I've been using Terra for the past half day and she, I, I'll get into the specifics, but the timing of her turn zero uh, rock solid is similar to um, Enchantress where I, it's weird why it happens after the enemy goes. I don't quite understand why certain turn zero skills happen that way, but it just is. So the yeah, as far, as far as I know, those are the only two. Yes. Uh, so she gets the debuff immunity, but hardly managed to squeeze uh, to get in her enrages before that applies. Um, but it's it really isn't that big of a deal because you still get your. Um, what you call this? The hit hey, chance. Hit, hit chance up. Yeah, yeah, so it's not that big of a deal. Hey, Johnny. All right. Uh, let's see. So Rock Solid is really good for agility ups, for hit chance up, 30% shield. Is this the highest shield or is it 35 for Dr. Fate? I can't remember, but 30% is a big... Uh, it's a big amount of right. shield. If you, have, if you have the legendary for that, that's also debuff immunity to the whole team. Correct. So that kind of makes Hal obsolete, no? Yes. In in right. a way, yes. The only difference is Hal gives you two turns. But uh, Yeah, true. But then again, she can just... That's still really strong. It is really strong. I was hoping to use Dark Side as lead. Uh, there was a team that I was using for a while. Uh, could someone ban Super Dude One Billion from chat, please? Thank you. <laughs> hey, puns are allowed. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, the, the team that I was using was Hal, Dark Side, Barda, and Azrael. So it can handle any team. Uh, I. I Typically, it even does decent on defense. Uh, the only reason I don't like it is because I wanted to use Dark Side as a leader, and now that Terra's here, I can I can uh, slot in Dark uh, Side. Just so you know, um, I can hear you on your stream just fine, but on Discord you're cutting out a lot. Uh, can you check your input sensitivity? I think it might be too high. Oh, okay. Let me see. How do I, I was getting that? that too, but I, I thought it might just be me and I didn't want to say anything. No, no. Uh, how do I change that? So input volume? Okay, so you uh, go I to your user settings, voice and video. Okay. And then you make sure input mode is on voice activity, not push to talk. And then on the input sensitivity dial, uh, it, you turn off automatically determine input sensitivity and then you slide it to the left. Wait, wait, wait. Where is that? So I, the input volume I reduce. Oh, automatically determine input sensitivity. Okay, I'll uncheck it, and then what do oh, I need whoa, to do? Oh, way quieter. All right. So what do I need to do? Uh, what's the input volume? Uh, I put it now at eighty percent. I'll turn it back up. You're really quiet now. All right. So now. All right. So then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's good. And then the input yeah, sensitivity. What would? What do you want me to do? Uh, just speak and look at the dial. What you want is to make it so that the entire time you're speaking, it's in the green. And if when you're speaking, the bar is in the yellow sometimes, then that means that it's not going to be picked up. Oh, okay. All right. So, okay. That should. Yeah. So if you drag it to the left a bit, it'll. Uh... Okay. I think that should do it. Okay. Yeah, can continue. Sorry, just just <laughs> important that the guests can hear you. I apologize, new machine. Otherwise, we, we have to nod along and be like, mm, yes, I agree, even though we have not. <laughs> <laughs> well, new map. Well, well, I'll figure this out. This is. It took me a while to get used to the old one. Get doing interviews in collabs like this, but we'll we'll get it sorted out. Sorry, guys. All right. So hope you can you guys can hear me better now. All right. So rock solid is a solid um, ability, as Super Dude says. All right, Tremor. Her AOE is now more consistent. 
before it gets just the weird uh 50 percent damage 25 percent damage now it's just that all right 75 percent chance to do it again it's not right. it's not that strong but it's not that weak either so i think it's a solid ability all right and then all right here's what here's one ability that i don't really like uh, the reason being she mostly has debuff immunity um, I guess this is more of a backup ability uh, uh, skill just in case you know she gets slammed with uh, let's say who gives a lot of debuffs um, maybe uh, speed downs from chemo or yeah you know, I, I had I hit her with um uh, siren team earlier and uh, you know siren can stack up bleeds pretty quick um, so that was one yeah I um I don't know I, I, I do find it odd when people um, get kits that kind of work against themselves like uh, first example that comes to mind for me is Supergirl because she has a lot of stuff that negates critical damage yeah and she does stuff when enemies crit but then she also lowers their crit chance it's like do you want them to crit or not it's yeah. really weird yeah it's... um but with this specifically, as you said yourself, the debuff immunity that you're going to get at the start of the match is only lasting one turn. Uh, so yeah, I think past that point, the fact that she can self-purge and then get an AoE out of it, it just makes you think twice before applying heavy debuffs to her. So I don't think it's a bad ability. Yeah, it, 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 it's a good backup plan. The other person that doing that annoys the heck out of me before is Ares. Uh, I don't understand why he gets debuff immunity when he wants to be enraged so he can stun. So anyway, I digress. Yeah. All right. So her second passive is if she triggers meltdown. So basically, her path it's like one big passive. So seventy-five percent to give uh, buff immunity to a random enemy, which is seems odd. I haven't triggered this yet, so hopefully we we'll get to see this today. Oh, wait, so is this a passive triggering a passive? Yeesh. It's it's almost just like a gate, like if the first passive happens, like if, if really what they what they should have done is made this passive ability the legendary on the first one, and then had the second one be, you know, grant the debuff immunities or, or something like that. Um, I don't know why they did it like this, but they did. <laughs> Yeah, this is really bizarre. It it kind of is. But also it's also been like this for a while, so also the idea of um it's one thing to give the debuff immunity and agility ups to the rest of your team when you die, but why two random allies? There's only going to be three people left. Just like one of them gets screwed. You why? know, she's going to say like, you know what? I don't like one of you. So mm, she's a villain. I mean, she's that, allowed that to is do in that. keeping with her character of just generally being a jackass for no reason. But like, come on. Well, she wasn't around for that long, right? And yeah, I guess she didn't also, like all of her teammates. In the bio thing that they released, it implied that she was going to deal damage to both friends and foes. Oh yeah, that's probably copied from her own. That's her copied own from her own one. Yeah, so they wanted to keep her ability to um, randomly lash out at her allies, but they decided that that would make her a liability to use. So instead, when she dies, she'll just randomly be spiteful to one person and not give them buffs. <laughs> it, it's probably just a passive-aggressive, uh, you know attack <laughs> as opposed to literally passive aggressive <laughs> as opposed so to a literal her, her damage old kit, passive though, aggressive it, passive it's slightly less passive her old kit was to grant debuff immunity and eight agility ups to the one. one random ally upon her death i mean this could all be avoided by not letting her die i suppose all right so we've talked about her a lot let's take her for a spin oh she's also lacking in certain departments kind of like starfire oh it's probably <laughs> christ okay no i i have no idea what you guys are talking about uh i don't know what's funny <laughs> 
hate mail has also been complaining about hate mail is also complaining about uh starfire they may have been uh, i'm mm, sure he is he, they may have been done by the same artist so yeah but mm, okay i'm speaking for hate mail here okay i am speaking for hate mail okay so download faster uh, I'm sorry, no one made you say that. <laughs> you chose to say that. <laughs> <laughs> yes. But you just give people the voice, you know. I thought you were playing all day. Like, why is your game still downloading stuff? Oh, I was playing on my phone. Oh, I see. I see. My game uh, does that as well anyway sometimes. Okay. Here we go. All right. This is the team that I have been using. Apparently, this can beat anything except this one. So let's see. Why do you have so many bots in the race? <laughs> I, I just got this board and I decided to keep it and try not to play because this might be useful. Uh, we can try out some of the siege bonus tunes, right? <laughs> And I believe people have been, I don't know why they like Ultraman so much. Two guys are in the 20k and that is insane. I'm now. wondering, what would happen if you put her under Atrocitus lead? What would go off first? Because if they all get enraged and then they get debuff immune and they have hit chops after they can't miss, Atrocitus, they could actually be pretty good. Would, Atrocitus would go first. But you know what? There's one of the best ways to find out is to just try it. True. So yeah, I'd say Atrocitus, Terra, and then probably Guy and Alan, probably. All right. Well, we need to beat this team, you know. Oh yeah, true. Um, we don't need to. <laughs> also, bringing uh, Atrocitus against Wonder Girl is not always the best plan, but, you know, you do you. I mean, um, that one is... Well, no, that's not the problem. The problem is more likely to be Terra with her metric <laughs> shit ton of buffs. But... No, but at least we can find out uh, if she dies. Yeah, it's for science. Yes, exactly, Darren. Uh, yes, sorry, Grim, I'm behind on chat, and yes, thanks, Hawkeye, it is Zubas and SVO. Alright. Alright, let's watch the timings. Alright, so they get enraged. Yep, dev alright, so we were right. Uh the leadership from uh Atrocitus goes first. That's honestly really cool. Like I my brain isn't quite processing where to take this next, but I feel like that's a nice order of events to have. Oh but Wonder Girl is being a. Mm, by purging the enrage. You know what? I'll just run right it in order. Yeah. yeah. Let's just see what they she, say. She likes doing that. She is a better fit. Ooh. So you were saying, Zubas, about Yo, using okay. atrocities about against what? Wonder Girl? <laughs> Yeah, well, she enraged her, she, she, she purged her own enrage, so that's her own fault, and she deserved everything that she got, okay? <laughs> okay, so... I did not expect Terra to be able to take out Wonder Girl there, that was really good. It was only a L3 Wonder Girl, so that might have played into it as well. Yeah, okay, it's so. probably a low B, yeah, level 70 L. She is getting power crept. She is. I don't, I don't like really fear her that much anymore. I know that that's something that you said when you bring out Clayface and you're like, yeah, she, you know, she's not that big a deal anymore. I do think she's going to come back into play because people still want to run Harley and the best way to deal with Terra it will be to run Harley and the server together. So Yeah, because she really, really hurts Harley. And the it kind of, she's kind of like a better Stefan Wolf. Yeah, kind of. And off lead, so. I am really high on Terra right now. Okay, so let's 
use this team. I, I want to revert this team. At, uh, maybe at least RB1 for each. Right. I don't know if I like Terra enough to just go RB5 straight. So, okay. So far, so good. We have not been obliterated by Wonder Girl, who's full L5. All right, let's see how. Ooh, okay. Stamina ups did their job. Uh, Terra took that pretty well. She did. And this is why. I like using. I, I really regret not use not taking uh, dark side all the way to RB five. All right. So what do we do with Terra? So I don't know if this is intentional, Mister Zubas, your enchantress expert. Does she uh, get the cooldown on her second yes. move? Yes. Oh. Uh, no, well, I don't know exactly how you meant that, but she starts with no cooldown on her second. Okay, yeah, so, I, I, yeah. I ask it the flip side, but you got the question answered appropriately. So right. basically, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I phrased it weirdly, but sure. So basically this way, right? She yes. can use it. All it's, right. a, it's the same as Terra, which I, I noticed earlier, and I was I was very surprised that that was the case. So that basically you can do it turn zero, and then you can do it again immediately if you need to. Um, which you know, again for Harley and Batgirl teams, you've now got eight hit chance ups on Terra's first turn if you want. Yes, and that's not wow. even the best part of it. So you are not forced to attack anyone. That is the best part of it. Yeah, I was gonna say if um, Batwoman gets a rework, which I feel like she might at some point, I'd like to see this for her, give her the ability to use her two again on her first turn to kind of stall. If she, yeah, that would be a good rework. And the other one is just fix the damn damage on that uh, Batarang. I have her RB five, and she still hits for three K. That's just stupid. In my in my experience, I think actually hits like harder than you expect and my Batwoman's only like L2 or L3 to the point where I actually can't use her most of the time because she doesn't kill anything but the counter still slaps yeah but the thing is at RB5 it still slaps the same way it should be much mm -hmm. stronger all right this team might be too good to showcase Terra <laughs> I mean I'm using three S tier oh I'm just spilling the beans yes we did vote uh, Barda S tier Spoiler, we, we recorded we, we recorded it today and I believe only one person did not vote uh, Barda S tier. I think it's because of personal experiences during Siege, but yes. Uh, normally, based on that description, I would guess Lou. No, it's not loot this time. <laughs> but I think loot actually really it, likes Barda. I, it's it's hate mail, right? Just not. It is surprisingly is it it is not hate mail. So oh wow, he okay. voted S tier even though he couldn't get her to proc. So yeah, surprise. No, but normally in my experience, hate mail will be like, oh, I had bad RNG on this character, but I feel like they're good, and based on what everyone else is saying, they're probably good. So I'm going to give them this rating based on what everyone else is saying, and then with loot. <laughs> It'll be like, on paper, this character is really good, uh, and everyone says they're really good, uh, but I personally am unlucky, so I'm going to rate them a D tier. Um, <laughs> that's what he does, like, every time. All right. Ooh, this is perfect. All right, let's pretend this. We're in Siege. I'm opening the Reddit post for the Siege bonus tube. Let's see if we can do... You've got uh, WGD, uh, Kid Flash. DOJ and Huntress. Uh, DOJ. So let's see. We are kind. Oh wait, no, 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 no. We're not I feel slow. Like Huntress might be important to have. Yes, uh, but this is actually good. I think this is full twenty. Uh, this looks like a Starfire match to me, actually. Yeah, but also, she has. Yes, you had that right. I still don't have a uh, Huntress gear. This. Somehow. This really, oh, you you know what? 
it is a Starfire match. However, yeah, you've got you've got Batgirl and Huntress with Evasion of, so. But she would steal the show from Terra, so let's just run with this. <laughs> okay. She'll she'll get her turn at the second half of the stream. Right now we're going to. Tr All right, so. This, you know what pains me is that uh, anyone who invested in Alman is probably not going to be happy with Terra right now. Um, no, no, I disagree. I uh, I still really like Alman, mostly for affinity reasons. That, yeah, I think yeah. Alman also does the crit ups, which Terra has has no impact yeah, on. The crit ups are really good as well. Mm, okay. So here's the thing: if you're playing like a a Lex team. Um, and you want like constant crits, constant buffs. Oh, Alman is still really good for that. And normally you'll be playing Lex, and then you'll have like some other green that you're buffing up. And then if you've got a third one, like Steppenwolf or Terra, at that point it becomes a very green heavy team. So I actually really like Alman for those reasons. I suppose so. All right. Like one of my one of my favorite old teams is um. Holy. Lex Orm. Ultraman and Alman, and there's no way I'm replacing Alman with Terra on that team. Holy crap. As wacky as it is. This is gonna be a good. Oh, this siege might be. I wonder if it's gonna be a hard siege. I can't figure it out yet. Ooh. Personally, to me, this looks like it might actually be a pretty fun siege. So. So the. We'll see. It. I think it all boils down how good Jericho is. Because Jericho looks he's, he's terrible, <laughs> in my personal opinion. So the, yeah, he, he doesn't look good. Oh, well, he is a he is a special. Is he a special striker? I believe he's a special striker. Uh, DOJ is gonna be pretty much useless <laughs> here. I actually, I don't think that DOJ is completely useless, um, only because she, like, all of her moves will hit now with the help of Terra. Yes. One of the reasons that DOJ, like, you know, her, her, uh, AOE, her AOE doesn't make sense is because it clears all the evasion ups, but it also doesn't hit like half the time. And now it can hit and remove the evasion ups. Um, so I think that that's a little bit helpful to her. She can also copy a lot of, you know, like Terra's uh, agility ups or, you know, Huntress's evasion ups. But, you know, whatever you've got on the team, she can copy those, which is pretty underrated, I think. My biggest problem with her is she's going to taunt like crazy and that will get her killed. Probably. And there's a Huntress. Yeah, there's a huntress. But she does get the hunters. she does get the death immunity though, right? No, she doesn't. She gives it to the others, not herself. Oh, that's right. That's right. God, I have not used her in ages. Uh, what would help is who? Someone gives death immunity. Grod. Grod would be perfect. Grod is going to be an absolute animal pun not intended uh, with Starfire. Oh yeah, uh, it ups. Yeah. Oh, I've actually um been gearing up Grod recently. So. Let's let's look for all right. Let's do this. Let's look for a tune that gives int ups and heals. Who would that be? Uh, int ups heals. and heals. Yes, Lex is <laughs> one. Don't say Lex. Don't say Lex. Active heal. Don't say Lex. No one. Th don't even think it. <laughs> oh, okay. There's only three tunes that does that, and two of them are selfish. Dark Side is one, Lex, as we said, and Black Lightning is the other. Yeah, I was gonna say Black Lightning comes to mind. All right, so nobody gives uh, int ups and heals team wide. All right, so you'll have to pick your poison, whether you want to heal or you want int ups. Anyway, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Terra, focus, people, focus. All right, Terra. All right, so let's see if we can keep DOJ alive. I have my suspicions that she's just gonna get herself wrecked. Um, although Wallace here might have something to say about it. 
Um, Why don't, I mean, I guess you could run her off lead too. Does that help? Nope, nope, it doesn't. It makes it worse. Because oh. as a leader, she gets, uh, let, let's see. I need to kill someone. Uh, we'll... Yeah, on the one hand, I feel like Wallace might be quite good to siege. And on the other hand, I really don't feel like in guess, uh, investing gear materials into him. Only to inevitably swap to Black Flash anyway when someone else gives up and swaps to Black Flash. <laughs> yes. So here is how it's slightly better because she heals when she taunts as a leader. Yeah. And then she gets a cooldown on her AoE, which is only great against evasion. Poof. All right. This is what I'm scared. All right. Let's see how well she takes hits. Knuckle push ups, ouch. I remember the last time I did a hundred push ups, um, I nearly died. So, for reference, <laughs> I um, I'd like only started working out recently, and so the most push ups I could do in a row at that time was like 10, maybe 15 tops. Um, and I was playing games with some friends, and like, I we made some dumb agreement where like if I died, I'd have to like get down and do five push-ups while I respawned um, and I ended up doing like 80 that night and I'd already done 20 earlier in the day <laughs> and I could not move my arms properly for like four days straight afterwards. <laughs> that would have been, yeah. <laughs> the worst I did was, uh, what did I do? Oh, squats. Squats are worse. You can't walk. I suppose not having the use of your hands would be, arms would be bad too. Okay, so, all right. So in Siege, looks like Batgirl teams are easy. Oh, there's a variation of this that's gonna be bad. Uh, there's one with uh, Grundy. All right. So. I'm surprised that of the the Siege bonus tunes. Um, also, shout out to WB for not even letting me do my contest this month uh the way that they <laughs> like just released that totally unexpectedly um there's no evasion tunes as the uh bonus tunes other than huntress hmm you're absolutely right and so it's like yes terra is great against the evasion tunes but, but like who's going to be bringing them in siege yeah, that's actually a really good point because what are you going to bring to deal with terror? Okay, here's Jericho. I don't know. DOJ? Like, how are you going to deal with terror? Oh, yeah, so that's why it all boils down to how good Jericho is because there's a lot of good greens Terra, Starfire, and then, dare I say, Kid Flash. And then I don't know what Blackfire would do. I feel like Jericho might be all right. He's just not going to be the savior of the entire siege. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, this is... I'm not going to say that he's guaranteed to be terrible, but I, I definitely don't see him uh, pulling through against like all of the greens. And here's the problem I'm seeing here, and a lot other people are also seeing this. They are heavy buffing tunes, and Wonder Girl is going to make a comeback. General Zod, what rock have you been sleeping under? And she is in the game now. Probably Although... one of Terra's. <laughs> yes, good one. All right, so can we do that this? Awesome. Don't lie to me. <laughs> it's good enough. I'm a gracious host. All right, so if Grundy decides to hit Wallace back, it's going to be bad. I wonder if the sh Ooh, how did where did that awareness come from? Did, does he gain awareness? I, he was a bonus tune during the flashes, but nobody used him, so I guess he gains awareness now, huh? All right. Oh, okay. So we can perch everyone. Okay, shields up. Oh, thanks, Darren. <laughs> You're right. Uh, oh, that means he purged. You're absolutely right. He purged. 
and I have him rebirth and I don't know his kit anymore all right is that strong enough to kill I wonder if this is a guarantee this is not a bad oh I'm also this is a bad test because I'm forcing myself not to use a oh, guy indeed yeah I've been hanging around with Josh way Ooh. too much. Ooh. Oh, we lost someone. Who did we lose? Zubaz. Zubaz. Oh no, he's gone way too early. He's taken from us. Alright, so who can deal with... Um, oh, Huntress. Let's give you... Oh, jeez. Uh, oof, okay, there you go, dead. This is bizarre. I just opened up my red alert and like every single team I can pick from is like a bot team. Oh, that means your uh, alliance mates are lazy? <laughs> okay. And they didn't play a whole lot <laughs> of... Uh, they didn't play a whole lot of uh, PvP. Did you Duncan pick... on the entire JLR, Christ. <laughs> Sorry. Are they here or are they sleeping? I don't know. I'll clip it and send it to them. <laughs> <laughs> do they know who I am? They're probably going to hate me if they do. Let's say some random streamer said something crappy about them. Mm. Who am I going to look at? Oh, why am I here? I'm going to... Oh, I finished my red alerts. I finished it. It, yeah, red alerts. Some days is like, like I said, bots, and then other days it's just like all of the dick teams from the owls, with a good sprinkling of the boy and sometimes Zubas. Oh, where was I going? All right, all right, more Terra action. I only then we got cocktail so short. Wait, a Mazel shards? Who? Oh, I'm, I'm not gonna judge people, at least not openly. All right, uh, Terra. I, you know what? Maybe we should be. Uh, oh, he lost a bet. Ooh. At least it's uh, amaz Just getting a Mazel shards not someone's bet um, the loser would revert Zatanna honestly I feel like reverting Zatanna isn't that bad because like she must get her rework soon right that's it. yeah that's the only thing it's an investment but Amazo you're gonna be stuck for quite some time yeah all right so maybe we should not try to use uh maybe that's Zubaz. Zubaz, he's back. Sorry, I was eating, uh, and then um nice. The lighting is perfect. I am almost invisible. What a compelling tale. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm eating and then like that was it <laughs> all right this I think this was the team I was testing earlier I wonder digestion if... intensifies <laughs> is, he, is he still here he's okay yeah, he's, he's, he's still here call. he's just not saying anything all right we are too slow but all right, how do I get um, heals from the bonus dudes? It's just Batman that heals, right? And no one else gives int ups. Oh, Wonder Woman kind of does. Oh, that, that, that stupid uh, code is going to ruin oh, our hell day. Oh, yeah. Board clear this month is Brainiac. That's great. I've been meaning to get Brainiac for ages. Um, I don't know if I will now, because uh, Terra feels like a lot of 
that, but yeah, he's been one of those characters where he's been on my list for ages, but I, he's not even um, five stars, let alone legendary. Who? Brainiac? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I, I wasn't um, playing properly when he came out. Oh. And he was like a PvP paywall character anyway. Back then I sucked, and I didn't get those characters when they came out properly. Because I didn't understand the way the um, PvP system reset, so I think I was like always at 900 trophies or something. Like a pleb. <laughs> good term to use we, we use the term peasant but that works too is this oh this are we gonna survive this uh, like well this is raid so who cares oh we didn't even look at her kit uh, let's look at her kit after this how long has Suba's been playing that was brutal with b12 uh, no that general zod it's 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 spo I was talking it wasn't Mr. Zubas. Wow. Really? <laughs> That's surprising to me, like getting the two of us the wrong way around this whole time. <laughs> it suddenly got a lot quieter. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. Hmm. I didn't realize how much Zubas brings to the table in terms of auditory effects. All right, so let's do this. This move I mean, I can, over here. I can try to. Fit, uh, I mean, I've got a ukulele in the corner. Like I can, I can try something. <laughs> <laughs> Intro. I if I count my puppy down and cut the stream. Wait, this the stream from your puppy or my stream? But I saw your puppy intro. A uh, cute. I, that was a. That was a, what kind of, you know those uh, Alaskan, Husky, that's what it is, right? Husky, it was yeah. a Husky. All right, so let's heal some more. Wait, can you guys hear me now? Yes. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Good. Um, you can't... Yeah, I'm for, I don't, are, are you planning on uh, buying any Blackfire? I might, if she's any good. Because she, she will help trigger Starfire with her two skill. Oh, you're saying this early? No, I I don't. I, I hope not. That's... Dang it. Why did you have to say that? <laughs> you're absolutely right. Her two does a medium overheal and a call assist. Is? Uh, black fire. Right. All right, so let's do this. This is a lot of int ups. Let's see if it's strong enough to kill. Um, and actually, black fire. She. I was looking at the list. I was like, okay, well, she's she's so good against these shielded tunes, but there's not many shielders. But there is Terra. Terra. Uh, yeah. yeah. With... So it's like, you know, you've got a pretty good chance to start stunning once Terra's debuff immunity falls off yeah that's uh, she gives a whole lot of shields 30 percent right and then she gets to do it again so lots yeah of so i do i i have a feeling that that blackfire will be one of those tunes that like if you got them earlier in siege would actually make a difference for you you know it's not like last month where like okay if you bought those two tunes nobody was even using them at the end of siege <laughs> Um, whereas this month I could see Blackfire actually making a difference. Yeah, and also she looks good compared to... Yes, correct. All right, let's do this AOE. Let's... I'm willing to bet Castaway dies. I don't know about Arcus, but she's kind of, he's kind of dumb, so he might die. So let's see. Oof, I wasn't expecting how to die. <laughs> So big. <laughs> that was chunky. Oof. Wow. Although you know what's missing? We don't have a Persure. Alright. Oh so dear. Just ask Burger if she's any good when they come up. Yes, Darren, that is the plan. Wait for Burger. Uh, and then 
Crash Burger. Why continue buying thing if WB refuses to do any major bug, cheaters, or anything like that? So, nothing in this world is perfect. This is my primary means of uh, entertainment. So, I enjoy 90% of it. The cheaters are annoying, but they have not been annoying me as much as they did in the past, which I was able to tolerate. And you know that. Uh, I had so many bridesmaids third place finishes in Siege in the past and it did not bother me as much. Uh, and yes, if we stop buying then this game dies. It's the game that a lot of us love for the past four years. It's a love-hate relationship. And like I mentioned in the past, I see this game as a puzzle and I love solving this puzzle, this particular puzzle. So until the day that it's no longer an challenging puzzle for me, entertaining puzzle, then I'm still here. I'm probably going to be here until they turn off the lights. And it's promising because there's another game that I used to play, how I got into this, uh, and just this one is still around. So this game's probably going to stick around for a few more years, at least a couple more years. Yeah, this, this game also has managed to stay away from the pitfalls of a lot of other games in the genre. Oh. Yeah. The one thing I like about this game is it's not a gotcha game. Yes, yeah, it's it doesn't aggressively monetize itself in the same way. You don't have legendary characters that require you to have all of the latest characters maxed out in order to get the, the new shiny thing maxed out. Correct. Because the meta until you need a team of the previous all of the previous shiny things to get the new shiny thing. And it's like, oh god. Yes. I, and, I really hate that kind of format. And two things. It one this game actually saves it saves you from yourself like there are uh sales that you want to buy more of they won't sell it to you which i find annoying and also thankful to wb4 for saving me from myself like rebirth tokens you can't buy more of them uh certain tunes you can only buy like just 10 not, uh, you can only buy 10 of them five of them at a time and also not being a gotcha game as you know what you're paying for most of the time so they say yeah definitely there's a there's some rng involved but they give you the minimum and you get at least those so if you just say think of it that way and everything else is a bonus then you're good look at how much they save you with love new chapter <laughs> Tyron, yes so i don't know the problem with the pve is it, unless it's a different game the new chapter series, here's my take, it's going to be just a farming, a new farming stage. You, that new chapter, yeah, we're going to just yeah. blow through it in one day, probably in less than an hour. I don't know how hard they can make it that we can't beat it in a matter of minutes on yeah, people, auto. People asked for like a new really challenging campaign and they were like, okay, we're going to give you the nightmare challenge and we're going to change it up every month. And we're going to give you rebirth tokens, which is like the currency that the actual end game players want. So we're going to make a challenge for them that gives them something they want done. And then they release that every month. It's different every month. And people are still like, oh, where's the new campaign? Like, what, what do you mean? <laughs> it's, it's like these people, they asked for some kind of crazy hard campaign for ages. And, and we what got they it. wanted was like a chapter nine. And then they were like, okay, we're going to give you a bunch of really hard campaigns. And they're like, no, we want one hard campaign that we beat once and then never play again. So what I do like in this game, for this game to have is some of the little polishes. There was a time when they updated the great uh, venues, arenas. Do you re guys remember the time when we had, uh, I think it was around the holidays, where we had the Gotham PD with snow, and then after winter, the yeah, snow I melted? I, I was like, dang, someone is paying attention. And then yeah, they, really yeah, and then they changed it to this, and then like, that stuck for years. I like, whoever that guy is, he probably left. And. Yeah. Remember when they had character? Yes, yes. Yeah. Hawkeye, yes. I was sad when they stopped doing that. Me too. And they kind of leak their own rework uh, around the time Swamp Thing. Uh, I remember 
uh, seeing Swamp Thing added to the load screen, it's like, whoa, Swamp Thing is getting it. That was a long time ago. Swamp Thing was one of the first Swamp year Thing's, we were. Swamp Thing's had a load screen since the game came out. No, did he? Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah, like day one, I remember. Anyway, they took him out of rotation and then he came back. I guess Maybe. Probably. I don't know. There's also I some. I haven't seen the, uh, the Supergirl loading screen in ages. Uh, like years. They definitely took that one out. Well, there you go. There's proof that they rotate it. They rotate it, like, I don't know, every five years, maybe. Uh, also, hey, Kitty, if M4 has had a haircut, good luck figuring it out. I did get a haircut, <laughs> but it's probably hard to see. Because I blend right. This is. I, I'm gonna keep this Shiva. Shiva background for a while. I'm almost invisible. Uh, so do you remember when... It, oh my god, bad memories, all right. No, I'm not going to go there. If you want to be really invisible, you need to move your screen like, like a quarter inch to the right so that it doesn't block any of her coat. Oh, okay. I might do he's, that. He's enjoying resting on Huntress's knee. <laughs> was that Huntress? I thought it was... Catwoman. That has to be Huntress, right? It might be. I, I. It does look like a purple knee pad situation. Well, there's quite a few heroes with purple. Batgirl, Catwoman, Huntress. Yeah, but none of them would really have bad eyes normally. It's probably Huntress. Probably. I. Oh, it's a. It's a comic book cover, if I'm not mistaken. It is definitely Huntress. Okay. There you go. All right. Ooh, I did not bring. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about the fact that I can pinpoint any comic character by looking at their thighs. <laughs> <laughs> we are not that very good. The, at... uh, that was from uh, Birds of Prey. That particular cover. Ah. Uh -huh. You see, I knew that already, of course. <laughs> oh my God, Starfire. Starfire and Grodd is like exceptionally unfair uh and i think like you know unfortunately his his permanent intubs don't always go to her but if they do it's just like game over <laughs> yeah she she is well i mean them being permanent doesn't matter because she poses them all for myself anyway well if he well that's true how do we maximize that um let's let me find more healers I don't even think that uh, Enchantress is the best leader for Starfire just because she wants teammates to get hit and damaged so she oh, can right. so she can proc her passage. So all right, so let me get heals cuz heals Oh, there's quite a few leader that heals. So let I, all right, let's find the perfect Oh, we haven't even looked at her kit. We got so distracted. Um, worth mentioning, if you happen to do the dark side Clayface thing, Clayface is three gives him like the most pathetic heal. I think it was still he yes, I know, I know. I, I I took that there was a time I was a dolphin in this game and I took that because it overheals. Exactly for that reason. Uh are you going to revert any of the siege tune? Hawkeye, I might do I might do Terra. She's the only one that excites me in the current list. And I do have... All right, Destro, calm down there. Wait, wait, wait. Why? <laughs> oh, <laughs> not that way, okay? She does not excite me in that way, okay? I had some comments that I would just hold to myself. <laughs> Same here, dude. I, I, I forgot. I forgot that I was like on a stream and not hanging out with like my friends from college, and I nearly just said something so bad. Yes. So thank you. I okay. need my filter. Save me. <laughs> All right. So let's look at Starfire. All right. Uh, basic. People that have the third tier subscription can hear SBO's comment after the stream ends. <laughs> All right. So let's look at this kit. Um, All right. Um, I've DM'd you an image, M4, and it, it's connected to this. That, that's all I'll say. Okay, let me look at that. 
Let's see. Okay, this is this. Oh, it has something to do with this, <laughs> this, this, this zip. <laughs> it's the legs. That's what we went down. Oh, okay. Oh, man. All right. All right, uh, Mr. Zubas, I'm going to need your memory. All right, so basic, if I am not mistaken, she didn't use to gain speed ups. She gains end ups. Not sure the uh, amount. It can't miss, but it doesn't purge. That's what I remember. Yes. Um, hold on, I can actually just look it up. But because uh, I, I, I didn't use uh, Starfire quite as much as I used Terra. Um, her old one, let's see, Starbolt, special damage to an enemy, uh, always gain three intelligent ups. The legendary was just can't miss. Okay, so that's it. Oh, three int ups, the same, same amount. Yeah, yes. Uh, there was no speed ups, same amount of int ups, and uh, there was no like purge of a random buff. Okay, can I can I say something really quick? Sure. I really want to know who it is who's been in charge of the purge department lately. Like I thought, Beatles <laughs> three was funny, where he can purge three whole buffs only from the primary target and only if they're Mystic Affinity. But I think fifty percent chance to purge a single buff might be the funniest purge in the entire game. I want to know if it would actually trigger. Silver I was Banshee's I was enemy. thinking the freaking exact same thing, Mister Zubas as. As Pio was saying that, it, it was already running in my head. And I, 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 I really I really like the idea that they had it like, okay, gain a speed up, three int ups, and can't miss. And then someone else was like, no, it's not good enough. No, <laughs> that that we, give you a we, make it, we make it purge two buffs, and someone else is like, no, we do one. And then management come in, and they're like, no, that's too much. You're going to make it a 50% <laughs> chance. This is too powerful. Jeez. Like, I want to know. Wait, I want to know how these how do we get made. it? I really change. wish I could see inside the dev department somehow. Mr. Zubaz, is there anyone that benefits from a purge that's guaranteed? I'm trying to think. Because Silver, Silver Banshee is like, I don't know, 30% or 50%, going to be 80 if there's someone with. Um, with Somebody blades. that dared. Um... I'm trying to think. Anyway. We'll, we'll keep going and it'll, it'll come to us, I'm sure. Uh, all right, so her two is... This one is always disappointing to me because it won't hit Harley. Uh, three hit chance downs and three evasion downs. All right, so thank you, Darren. I'm, I'm looking up the, uh, the what it used to be from the wiki. So... I wonder if it's enough hit chance downs. No, it doesn't matter. That hit, that hit chance down doesn't help. It's the evasion downs. Yeah. Okay, and then 50% chance to stun. Oh, it used to be 25, all right. And then seven. Oh, it's the same. Okay. Oh, okay. It used to be 25%. Now it's 50, and now 25 additional if they have evasion up. Yeah, it's still kind of sucky. They just increased the base to be 50, but still max of 75. Slightly better. Still not a great move. I would just spam her basic. I don't know why yeah. I, would, I would use this. Unless you're desperate and hoping to get, to get someone to be stunned to survive. But otherwise, I would just spam basic. All right, and then we just saw this in action and oof, okay. This is I think my Starfire still isn't legendary. I need to check actually. This is also phrased a little ambiguous. Loose, yeah, it's loose, very strange. Lose all int ups. Max five. Max five. So all or five. Okay. <laughs> so no all right. So I think what they meant here is lose all int ups, period. Apply 10% additional special damage per int purge, max 5. That's where it should be. Right. Yeah. Exactly. All right. And then... I think, I think that's what it is. Yeah, it's the, it's the 
additional damage that caps out. Yeah, God, that took me a minute. I thought I was having a stroke reading that. And then can't miss. Oh, this is the best part here that they added. It's uh, can't miss if she has the five int ups. It used to be twenty five percent extra damage. Uh, did they? Did she has the? Ex yeah. Oh, okay. She didn't used to have the. Okay, I see what they did here. Fifty percent additional damage on her basic move. I mean pre legendary, and then added the can't miss. Okay. Yeah. So pretty good, pretty good change. I think that's her bread and butter. She used yeah. to this. She just destroyed the invis meta back in the day when she came out. Oh my god! Don't even remind me. I I used to run that uh, clayface red robin mirror master. Was it? Yeah, I remember one time I was um, I was playing a red alert, and. No, it wasn't a red alert. No, it was a, it was a wraith match. Or maybe a shit. I can't. I can't remember. Wait, it was, it was match, and um, a check, and the starfire was like four, three or four k power, like around there. Um, and I was like, oh okay, oh this will be fine. And then I went in, and my entire team got one shot. <laughs> and I was using like level seventy gear eleven, and she was like gear eight or something. Did, did, did you... Like, that's just fucking broken, like, how? <laughs> yeah, the, that was G10 days, right? Yeah. And Clayface no, was... No, no, I, I was on offense, like... Oh, okay. It wasn't in my battle log. No, like, it actually, like I just watched it happen. I brought, I brought in... um. Oh, you're the... Yeah, I brought in Robin and Red Robin and Clayface, oh, that was... like someone else. Okay. And I was like, oh, this Starfire is like 3.9k power or something, so I'll be fine. <laughs> I got nope. one shot by her anyway. Both, both Robin and Red Robin got one shot. I, I have a love-hate relationship with uh, Starfire. Uh, when she came out, she was god dear for two weeks. Right, because she was broken with the passive heals triggering her? Yep. And the reason I hate her so much is it forced me. I say forced, very liberal here. Um, to gear Superman, Shazam, and I forgot if I already have Power Girl geared up at that time. Because they were just like insane with those. Uh, Shazam, he fast heal, uh, taunt, and then Soups just stands there just heals every turn and she's just insane it took them two weeks to i don't know if you call it a fix or a nerf but for those two weeks she was godly yeah uh, I, don't even, uh, I don't even want to imagine what would have happened if that happened during a rework lex <laughs> <laughs> i don't even think it would oh god dang it you're right it would have been yeah, just anyone because that's a passive heal Oh. And it gives you an ups. Oh, sh oh lord. Oh yeah, that would have been bad. <laughs> no, good thing. That would have just been an instant win button. Yeah. The, the number of tunes that can actually trigger her is is not that high. It seems like. Yeah. We'll 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 get there. All right. I I I, I have the, excuse me, the DCL toolkit. See you, the healers. All right. Um. What did they change here? Uh, it's it's pretty much the same, isn't it? Oh wait, they nerfed her. I am reading the old kit from the wiki, and it says here that the supernova cooldown was minus two. Yes. And now it's minus one. Why? Oh, because it's much more powerful now, I suppose. Yeah, and they gave it the can't miss. That's that's a big trade off okay i guess that's okay and then she gains quite probably got his rework he was insane with his bug until they fixed it was it a bug i thought it was just the buffs lasted longer no when he went during his first rework uh the duration of his buffs was two turns and yeah. i was so happy it was two turns and then they lowered it to one at some point yeah the next the very it. next day and it was super annoying 
and then yeah, she got a cool. rework, a re rework, and then they just did that. Like, hey, look what we did. Hey, here you go. Okay. Yeah, nah, I've always loved Damien. This game always had a soft spot for him. Okay, 75. Ooh, okay. 75% to you, Starbucks. Is it, was it always 75%? I couldn't. I can't do math right now. I'll just say it's roughly the same. Alright. Alright. Let's not do this anymore. Let's just do it like Josh does. He never reads the kit, right? <laughs> so Do you reckon she'd work well on my um Captain Cold teams since she benefits when her teammates take damage? Kind of, but I don't know if Well she'd get her basic yeah, which means by the time she actually does get a turn, she'll probably be quite buffed up. Yeah, that might be worth trying. It could be, I mean... Um... Yeah. Yeah, okay, so... Let's give it a shot. Yeah, so you want cold and starfire, and then... A means to survive. Barda. Barda I would take. Uh, I won't take Azrael, because... Just because he's really good, yeah. Yeah, he okay, would just... Kota. Um, how do we survive? Uh, let's find a healer. Uh, let's yeah, use... I was going to say bring a healer. Uh, let's okay. find a good healer. Hmm, heals. Okay, Wait. So prefer preferably a mistake. Wait. According to the DCL toolkit, there's only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven healers in the game. Is that... No, you must have another filter on. Okay, clear all there's filters. Ni there's 19 healers, but I don't know how many of... I, I would have to go through and see which are active. Oh, which okay, are gotcha, gotcha. Okay, I have the leader uh, as a... Okay. Go. All right, so let's see who would be... The fastest one would be Black Lightning, right? Uh, Aqualad, I think. Oh, yeah, but he sucks, Ooh, though. Oh, yeah, Aqualad. But he puts damage immunity on someone with a skill, which isn't really what we want. Hey, you know what? The fastest is actually Kid Flash, but it's well, a passive. It's a passive heal. Yeah, it's heals a passive. Okay, so fine. Let's uh, use Aqualad then. Yeah, I think I think Aqualad would be fine. But his basic sucks, though, right? We need someone uh, whose basic yeah. does not suck. No, Aqualad basic is pretty good. Yeah, bleed because he puts on bleeds and then they and then he converts them to permanent bleeds. Yeah, bleeds and straight down, and then he converts them to permanent bleeds. But in this why do you hate Aqualad so much, man? Come on. I don't Aqualad hate. Really I don't hate <laughs> him. Look, I paid the one thousand gems to change him to his. Uh, <laughs> what is this costume? Is this this? Um, what's that show? Young Justice. Yes. Young Justice. See, I don't hate him. Sounds like you hate him. I just don't like him. All right, so we did get hit once, and I have three intelligence up. I'm gonna use my two on Siren. Oh no, I'm gonna save it yeah. just in case she gains it. All right, heal. No, we don't want. Don't want to um, get the damage so immunity. Cold. Because he's about to take a turn anyway. Okay, good, good call, good call. All right. It's funny when it's Aqualad too, because you can't even see what the heal was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we need to stun Siren because she's the most annoying one here. Yeah, for sure. Things... Of course, she's one who ended up with a death immunity. Things are welcome. Well, we have a perch. We just have to wait for it. Yeah. Oh, uh, we'll go for the nuke, I guess. See what happens. Ooh, that's a lot of it. Partially are catching the stream because it started very, very late. <laughs> that, okay. Wait. What? Where is that int up coming from? Why does she have an int up? She gets them when people get hit. No, 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 she just took a turn, right? 
Oh. Um, but then she got one after some. Uh, hold on. Yeah. How did she one. get it? Is it is it permanent or not? Check the. No, um, no one turn. One turn. One turn. So. <sighs> Why this, this things bug me? Ignorance is bliss, but now I've seen it. I need to know. <laughs> I wonder if she only had six int ups, and and they were that is five. that is <laughs> what I was she thinking had, because she had my moment six. There's nothing in her kit that after she does that move that she should gain one. Yes, and no one here should give hint ups. Damn it, where did you get that freaking hint up? <sighs> that is the mystery for tonight. She couldn't make it easy, could she? Jeez. Alright. Now we have to run this team again. It, it didn't... I, I double-checked just, just in case I was going crazy. It did not come from Captain Cold. Mm -hmm. yep. nope. It did not come from Barda. And it does not come from Aqua. <laughs> so where the hell did it come from? I'm not running from a bug. <laughs> oh wait, hate mail has her RB3. We should report the bug. <laughs> All right. Okay, so now she has three intelligence up for two turns. Okay. And a purge. Please don't. Okay, good. Oh yeah, you can just use the three because you get the damage immunity, so it doesn't matter. Oof. Woo. Okay, alright, alright, alright. We're almost there, we're almost there. Uh, which one is the one that gets strength, strength downs? I think it's the basic, right? Okay. Alright, here we go. Alright. So, who's that in your picture, Trese? <laughs> no, that's not Trese, Pingzo. That's Shiva. For those of you that don't know, uh, Trese is a... Um, it's a Netflix show due, uh, due to come out in June, I believe. And it's based on Filipino mythology. Alright. Two, four... Alright, let's, <laughs> ju let's just agree there's a shit ton of int ups here, okay? Where is Testy when you need to? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Oh, man. Twelve. Was she was stepping on Hunter's neck. Twelve. All right. Twelve. Okay. Twelve. Oh, it's unfortunate that she, he's got awareness, but it's okay. All right. All right. We're gonna slow it down so we can see the end ups disappear. All right. Twelve. Right. Holy yeah. crud! They did not lie to us. That was accurate. Holy fuck. <laughs> what? So the text is... Alright, so lose... <laughs> okay. You only lose 5 int ups. Lose, lose all int ups. In ups. As long as it's just 5. <laughs> that is so bizarre. Oh my god. I think it's the way it was written before. Oh god dang it, I closed it. I could have pissed myself. Please don't, but it is kind of funny. <laughs> that is incredible. Seriously, you, you're surprised? No, I mean, I'm not. <laughs> I'm just, I... It's, it's like they find new ways to, to make bugs and text issues. Like, when I, when I read... Um, 
like on on the black flash kit reveal when it said like reset enemy turn meter and i was like there's no way that's all turn meter on the whole team but that's it gonna is going to be primary target there's no way but it is <laughs> all right so let, let, i i want to digest this because all right as people know, English is not my first language. I think I've learned enough of it watching movies that I understand and speak it well enough to comprehend what WB is trying to tell me. But I also work in computers programming, which involves a lot of logic, and that just makes my brain hurt. Remove all in max of five. <laughs> I would phrase it like remove up to five. Anyway, we got the intent now. So if that if that is actually what the developers intended, I will pay you every dollar in my bank account maximum <laughs> of five. <laughs> but now we know. So like G.I. Joe says, knowing is half the battle. <laughs> uh, that that makes her so dangerous. Like, yes. I also don't <laughs> understand why the cooldown doesn't get reduced that hard. Wait. Was Grace Detective is featured in this seed? Yes. Yes. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes. <laughs> he, she would just like insane. <laughs> All right. So, Mr. Zubas, as an American kid growing up, did they ever. You watch all of the G.I. Joe episodes? Uh, I did watch quite a bit of G.I. Joe. Did they ever tell us the other half? Not to my knowledge. Um, God damn it. Yeah. All right. I will say that knowing is half the battle, but I don't know the other half. Probably the battle. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think, I think we call, I think. Right, like the other half is like, you know. I don't, I'm, I'm spitballing here. I've never seen an episode <laughs> of G.I. Joe. I'm a filthy Brit. Well, I'm Filipino, They're pretty so. formulaic. Um, I don't know. I think that's just in in the animation. In comic books, I heard they die quite often. Like, they kill, right? Yes. All right. This is very enlightening. All right. This is very enlightening. Now I'm excited about Starfire. Is there anyone who has like an active heal move that also messes with turn meter in some way, either upping ally turn meter or messing with enemy turn meter? Yeah, doesn't mm. doesn't WG D do that? He gives a, uh, a heal. Well, his three I, yeah. is a heal that also gives 100% turn meter. Right. I mm. wanted to use him for his two in, in my brain. Can't you use him for both? No, I'm trying, <laughs> I'm trying to come up with a really fucking stupid team comp. Oh. oh. <laughs> Hang on. So wait, so you what do you want? You want an active heal with also turn meter? Turn meter manipulation in some way. Yeah. It doesn't have to be, but like oh, if it's shit. Shit. I just helpful. know how to make Starfire like ridiculously good. All right, I think we need world's greatest detective, Donna Troy. Yeah, Starfire. Uh, Starfire and Gorilla Grot. Grot, you reckon Grot? Yeah, because or anyone that. Uh, you you know what I, what I was gonna say is actually if you do oh, Medfill I... as a leader and then sw- can and make WGD off lead. Or we could just do this like go nuclear on people. Uh, where is she? This is... Pulling this Martian? No, just do this. Oh, 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 oh my god, oh yes. Right? Right? Oh, I'm so ready, I'm so ready. Right? Oh, my body is ready. <laughs> Give it to me. Oh, well, we still need to survive the f- initial hits. <laughs> Wait, that's so anticlimactic. <laughs> <laughs> you have angered Wonder Woman. God, M4, you've been playing so... You, you're 2,600 trophies. I, I... I got... I was so bored. 
and I was trying to get uh, what was I trying to get oh Stefan wolf shards which I don't need anymore all right here we go here we go all right okay let's try to kick someone in the face not to piss no. off that's okay we just need to turn we just need to freaking turn all right here we go here we go Oh my god, I just see the fireworks going on right now. Oh god, I can I, I can see it and I'm not even ready. Okay, who do we want to give the turn to? Starfire, I would do Surely that. Starfire. Four? Well, yeah, before she does it, count how many end up she has. What, what, what does she gain? Does she gain turn meter when someone gets healed? No. No, she doesn't. Um. Alright, one, two, four. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. She'll gain a few more. Now I'm gonna count again. God dang it. Five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wait, why did she not gain more? Lex should have given her more. Two. Seven, no. eight, nine, no. ten, well, eleven, twelve. Was greatest detective three doesn't give any buffs. It's ten. Oh god, dang it! You're right. I was thinking of it. All right. Anyway, all right, all right, all right. Is this strong enough to kill Koda? Anyway, no. she's got awareness. But I don't think it matters. She got reason, awareness, so she's know. she's not gonna get killed. All right, let's do this. And she has death immunity too. Ooh. Go go go. Uh, oh, uh, almost. Moist. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <coughs> Holy shit, she's gonna do it again. Oof. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> We've broken the game. That actually didn't hit as bad as I thought it would, though. Yeah, but it's about to happen again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we need. Oh, okay. yeah. oh, but he's this team is slow. We need to find a better way to do this. Yeah. Oh, uh, how do we do this better? That's why I'm suggesting Medville. All right, here's a That's dick, dick team. All right, this is a big dick, dick. All right. Uh, okay. The good thing is they're slow. All right. All right, Starbo also wants. <laughs> I made sure to add team at the end intro. All right, now uh, let's see. Let's give it to Lex first. Let's do this. All right. Perch those. Oh All my right. God, Cassie is just gonna get. Screwed up so bad because they can't miss. Can you... <laughs> yep. All right. I got a dick theme for you after this, though. Okay. Uh, Pingzil has a question. Can you world engine most of the opposing teams? Can you try a Martian Manhunter Black Flash team with three bonus and DT? Uh, I don't know. I need to find one. Let's find one. Wow, they survived. The good thing is, we can just try it again. Oh, she's gonna die. She's just gonna freaking do it again. <laughs> oh my god! Nobody show this to hate mail. This is fucking disgusting. <laughs> wish he came back. <laughs> I want to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So this. All right. Let's let's try something different. All right. Fuck this is. Hell. All right. Let's try something different. Oh, this is way too fast. Can't can't handle this. Um. 
this? How about if we do it this way? Uh, where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, what the world creates detective lead and then Wally? No, um, Grod. Grod, Grod, yeah. We're slow, but we'll see what we can do. Is there, um, is there any team that you want to go against? Because I still have you on my board. Uh, let's see. I don't know yet. We'll find, guess we'll find out. All right, heal, Donna. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Cause that would just piss off Azrael. Yeah. Lex is better. I can just see it now. Oh. Lex is a better leader than WGD? <laughs> no way. <laughs> no, I... <laughs> this, this is the hard-hitting analysis that your stream fans come for. No, I'm just thinking, because if you get a kill from uh, there, that's exactly what I was looking for. If you get a kill, um, then she gets the int ups, right? Right. And then you kill, you get some more, and nobody died. God dang it. Oh, man. Well, there you go. As I just refused. All right, so... Argus. Nah, Lex is the best one. Yeah, probably. I do like Grodd though. What about Lex and Grodd? Ooh, that, that might be. Oh. <laughs> so then you'd have then you'd have to drop um Oscar's Detective or Donna. Right. Um, which which I don't think is. Yeah, yeah, I mean you're damage reduction. Right. Yeah, we don't need the yeah, we need the turn meter reduction, but we need to choose one. Who else reduces cooldown? I think it's just those two. But I like cooldowns anyway. There are a lot of people who reduce their own cooldowns. Yeah, but yeah, other I think it's just those two. All right, so okay, so Pingzo was asking for how to beat this with yeah, three bonus. bonus. All right, I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna save that for later. All right, I'll I'll check the uh the cooldown effects then. All right, in oh look at the defense log, not bad, not bad, and now it's gonna be bad because I've been messing around with dumb things. All right, oh jeez, this is going to get wrecked, I think. All right, so how do we get kills? Hmm. How do we go fast? The fastest heal is Black Lightning, right? Or Aqualad. Aqualad, yeah. S oh. is active heal, yeah, it's Aqualad. We'll do something different. All right. Uh, all right. Mysterious words lesson legendary is her five. If that's the one that is on any uh, her death, then yes. Yeah, that's that's the one to leave off if you have her out for for sure. All right. So let's heal Lex. So he buffs first. Is that enough? Do I get five? No, it's just four. <sighs> Wally isn't great. Who would be better? Fast. Probably Grodd. If you're gonna give up Donna, probably. Yeah, but. Donna, because you want the speed. Yeah, um, I want the speed though. Yeah, so I can go first. And this isn't strong enough to kill. Well, at least they're... Yeah, Miss Martian could be good. Still too slow. She's 112 or something. She's kind of slow. Yeah, I'm looking through the list. I'm pretty sure no one else does team cooldown stuff. Yeah, this doesn't work. The only one that gives intelligence ups 
to the team are Wet, Miss Martian, and Miss Martian, and Grad, and Fate. Yeah, and Fate. He's so slow. Is that it? Let's see. Where are um, we? Int ups. Two team. Hippolyta I does. I... Hippolyta does. Oh, Hippolyta, that's right. She's the fastest. Um... Oh, yeah, Hippolyta Lex. Still not, like, great, but... No, that might work. Something. That's gonna work. Because she's fast enough. Damn, you die, all of you. Oof. Oh my god, alright, so now what I need to do is freaking worry about hate mails RB3, Starfire, and Siege. God dang it. Oh, she'll be RB5 before Siege, right? No, 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 she's... She, I don't know. It depends on when she's gonna be sold. I hope she's sold at the, towards the end. <laughs> oh my god. Jeez, she's gonna be super scary. All right, so let's look at the. All right, let's let's try to solve the Pingzo's problem. All right, so how can you beat this with uh, three? Uh, this might be bad because of uh, impulse. Oh, I know how to solve that problem. I think I can solve it. What do you want? Just a Martian Manhunter Black Flash team? Yeah. Oh, this one's perfect. All right, how can I... Pingso, your question is if I can do three bonus, right? Wait, 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 wait. Your question is three bonus and DT. Donna Troy? Yeah, that's a weird requirement. No, no, she's... I thought he said, he said world engine. Yes, that's his question. Oh, WGD yeah. is a bonus, that's right. Yes, this is, okay. this is what he's trying to do. If you can survive and hit back I don't think you're gonna get the turn because M4 just have all sabotage great so hate mail can get the turn. no <laughs> Darren no because I'm gonna use I'm gonna lose my own tokens so no I just don't see Harley coming out in the siege <laughs> like they would be so dumb to bring your own Harley <laughs> yeah it would be yeah. you're just asking to be revenged all right, so uh, Wally is. In other news, I think this might be the day that I uh, finally pull five World's Greatest Detective. I've had the resources for it for ages. I don't think this is possible, Pingzo. You're not gonna get a turn. Um. How can I survive this? Uh, this is not gonna work. No, I'm happy I didn't RB5 Harley. I feel like you'd want Starfire in this team somewhere. Maybe. Because that's kind of the point of having the engine, isn't it? Yes. I just want to use... Uh, for this and then she just died <laughs> I really don't know what you were thinking though oh, Terra would have worked uh, so how do things though I don't think that's gonna work uh, let's try to use the two ladies um, But I think we're gonna get wrecked. I don't think it's gonna work. Even if it works, it's not gonna work reliably. Alright, I'm for I sent you like a basic siege team. And then look at this, it's gonna work. I just need a turn. Now Donna Troy's gonna die. And this Donna Troy is 
RB5. So chances of this working for you. Wonder Girl, D, uh, World's Greatest Desire, DT Terra Star. Yes, I think so. This is exactly what I'm running. And no, I don't think so. I don't think so. Why didn't you use the uh, nuke? Because it, I already lost the tune. It's pointless. I guess. M4, I sent you um, Martian Manhunter Black Flag. Oh, okay. Series. Perfect. Perfect. All right. So let's see. Um, I still think you lose someone. I did see intro. Space Array. I love how your Terra goes after the enemy Terra as well. That is exactly like Enchantress. Yep, yep. It's like there's a turn order of, not turn order, but like specific events for turn zero. Uh, those leaders on your side, leaders on the other side, and then the non-buff move. No, the other doesn't matter if it's a buff move or a, a silent buff. What I mean by that is like certain tunes like Clayface would clap and then there's dudes like Barda who would just, you know, just gain the taunt. But it doesn't matter. It, um, by the way, Terra AI just used her two as a first move as well. Interesting. She, that that was what she led off with. So now you've got the enemies have eight agility ups and sixty percent shield. <laughs> the good thing is oh, no, agility ups, Starfire. Yes, I was just gonna say that Starfire probably doesn't care, but the shields might. So let's see how this works out. Uh, Huntress dies as expected, and. Think so. This kind of worked, but I don't think this is anyway. I don't think this is reliable. I think Donna Troy is just a liability. <laughs> I just really do. Yeah, if she wasn't RB five, she would have. Okay, and then once you get to the point where the Reds are dead, I don't know if I think between Terra and Starfire I think you're going to see a lot of Wonder Girl in this siege I please don't say that please just say and that. and Kid Flash I mean they've got who else uh between Wonder Woman, DOJ, yes. Huntress, Cape Flight, everybody, they're all just like crazy buff tunes. And then the way to take out Kid Flash, Terra, and Starfire, I mean, Wonder Girl seems like the most obvious option. <laughs> yeah, so I think though this, is, this isn't a very good team either, because once the red dies... Yeah, everything just kind of stalls. Yeah. I mean, she hits hard, but not hard enough. I have a dick team with Wonder Girl after this. Okay, now let's back out of this and beat intro. Oof, this is bad. Uh. So, Costly is reformed. He had, ever since he went uh, for Siege Top 10, he stopped being a dick. <laughs> Sorry, I, 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 let me rephrase that. He stopped using dick themes. However, th so now we only have one resident. What was the right term? Dick. <laughs> no one that constantly uh, 
few stack tech teams and it will all come to us all right i hate this i i don't know the answer but i really like the idea of there being a word somewhere in the dictionary where the definition is and i quote one who spews dick <laughs> i hate kota jeez all right the only way to deal with this is to not die from kota retaliation i i so want to nuke that nah Br brain was great detective go on try it Oh, you want to? Okay. Oh, let's do that. Yeah, I, th I think I think you can do it. Okay, let's see. I believe in my boy. I am going to take requests to change the costume. I just want to use this because I did spend a good amount of gems to get this. <laughs> no, I really like the Zorana skin. Glad to see it in action. It actually now, looks... Not that you would do this in Siege, but... There is a way to lower cooldown without having to bring down a Troy. Oh, and that is to it, die. It's to actually use her passive and bring like Lobo or somebody, you know, somebody that you just want right. to die over and over. That's actually a really good point. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like I, I thought of that. A Lobo, a White Lantern, a, a Cersei type situation or whatever, and then she's just going to do it every turn. <laughs> Who is. But Lobo doesn't die easily anymore. Yeah. He does if you didn't gear him up like I did. <laughs> <laughs> True, but I feel like the, the, the days of Lobo are kind of over because everyone recognizes that he's good enough to gear up properly. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right. Here we go, buddy. All right. Oh, let's just use this so she gains a bit more end ups. All right. I'm smarter now. All right. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. What? All right. Do we want a piece of coda? This is the RB four coda. Yeah, you've got awareness. You'll be fine. Crush viability. I believe both of them are pretty darn good. So, I didn't use Starfire until the stream. I was already high on Terra. I think she is a good replacement for both Star, uh, Stephen Wolf and Hal Jordan. But now I'm. Does really... he mean specifically like what level you need them at? Oh wait wait, wait 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 wait! I missed one word and it's dangerous. Viability level of Terra and Starfire. I would say Terra and Starfire would be both L four. Let Let's double check out. Oh. Ooh. Um... Terra, I, I do think that Terra, you can get away without the heal immunity on her basic. I think it's really helpful, but I don't think it's like absolutely necessary. I like um, it because when you're lazy and you want to just beat any team, she can she does it. Uh, she can take care of evasion teams, re revive. Whatever. Yeah, no, listen, I, I think that it is really helpful, but I think if you only had l3 i think she'd still be excellent. oh you mean like she's gonna be That's viable yes yeah use all the twos holy shit she's gonna do it again nope not quite starfire all right here we go here we go definitely needs one definitely needs three all right, how much damage can we do here? Oh, the blue and an RB4, so... I, I think you can get away with Starfire at L2. I'm gonna be honest, that's pretty good damage, like against an RB4 blue. Yeah, considering she's just L5. Yeah. Yeah, I've I've always had a soft spot for the Doom engine. I hate this just because. Uh, 
all right intro you can send me a new team all right let, let's look at the kits again all right uh basic i think you need this you can't miss it's just too good to pass up this you probably don't need this you definitely need you don't need this you can get away without this but it will be great if she has it because you'd be proccing this a lot so l2 usable l3 would be good all right let's look at terra terra earthling female Lemon. you i really like this you want this you want this you don't need this i think you want her l4 i really think you want her l4 so, um i think i think she's fine at l2 i think the two and the four are the most important yeah, ones i think basic. the one and the three are nice and then the five you just don't need yeah so if i were to do this i would just straight this two as like equal you don't use them you don't use her if she's not l2 and then L3, you'll take this. L4, you'll take this. And then here, yeah. L2, she's fine. Yeah, I guess L2 for both. Yeah, it's like with um, Cheetah. Like her, her one, her two, and her four, they're both nice. But what you really need it's is just to the, the... use three at the start of the match and to turn Meteor up on the three. Like, you just need those two. And then she does her job, right? Yeah, that's, that's right. Everything else is a bonus. I'm running out of uh... all right so let's all right so this team is good but in reality there's very few teams you can beat with this because you're too slow the way to make this work is all right Alright, let's let's make this a really viable team. Alright. So let's use Barda to get pe people to hit her and piss off uh piss off Starfire. Oh my god, this is just going to alright, let's let's test this how much um Wonder Girl is gonna ruin her I mean both of them actually. Alright. So in order to survive this. How do we survive this? Oh I know what to do. Alright, let's try this. So this is not a siege team, but just something that might be viable in raid. Right. Did the all right? It kind of pissed off Starfire. Oof. And she's dead. Oh, she survived. Now she's dead. Too many rips. Yeah. Can we stun? She's gonna shake it off. And this is why I love Barda. Mm, she's gonna die. Yeah, okay. So, if you see Wonder Girl on Siege, those two cannot come out and play. <laughs> they, all right, let's... Yeah, they, they can't. Wonder got such a big. All right, that's gonna be bad. All right. Mm, okay, we have a peasant wonder girl. <laughs> or as SBO would say, a pleb. Or plebeian, if you're feeling adventurous. <laughs> All right. Is this really a... All right. I don't know how to use Starfire. <laughs> we just saw what Wonder Girl does to those two. What if we play Fire with Fire? 
fight fire with fire, okay? All right. And then how do I protect those two? Mm. I like how fire with fire is L4 Wonder Girl versus RB5 Wonder Girl. That's like <laughs> fighting fire with napalm. I mean, I didn't say like, it equal. Like fighting <laughs> fire with a much bigger fire. Yes, uh, maybe Elon Musk's uh, not a flamethrower versus a match, but we'll see. I am still dumb enough to bring three greens though, so let's see what happens. I think B12 is a really good option for Terra because she, if you are taking her against Harley, he covers her the, one fault right now. Yeah, the Enrage. And then obviously the protection against Wonder Girl. So so I think for like those Harley Wonder Girl teams, Brainiac plus Terra is is gonna be pretty viable. That's what God, you get. I've forgotten how dumb Wonder Girl versus Wonder Girl matches are. <laughs> this is so stupid already with also with like Enchantress and everything. <laughs> Uh, all right, all right, all right. You, you started this intro. You started this. Now I want to punch someone in the face. And this is why you want Terra's basic. Uh, you took the puppy out. Okay. Um, <laughs> Wonder Girl happened. That's what happened, Intro. Wonder Girl happened. So yeah, Wonder Girl versus... Oh wait, you're still here, Mr. Zubas. So what's the best way to deal with this? Do I want to deal with speed versus speed? Oh, there's no Wonder Girl, so... Alright, this, this might... Be a good. All right. Uh, piss off. This might actually work. This might actually work. I forgot if Terra heals. Terra kind of heal. Uh, not Terra. Barda. She passes. Barda's, yeah, no, I think, I think it's just stamina ups. No, is it? She has a, he, oh, the men's. The men's. Yeah, this guy, the, her three does the men's, but not heal. Anyway, so this might work. So you're in this. This should get rid of all your buffs. I'll do this. And then now we're on equal footing. I'm not quite buffed up. So who do I want to deal with? I'll just... This might actually work. Do I have enough? Is this five? Yeah, it is yeah, five. Yeah, definitely five. Oof, okay. This is definitely right, viable. Right. This is viable. Uh, let's see. Let's heal her up. Used, oh, should have used basic to get more. This is not a bad team. Yeah, this seems like really viable. Spam the basic. Ooh, yeah. Bar the getting hit. Look, look at how pissed off Starfire is. Yeah. 
burger friends. Are they? I don't think she gives a rat's ass about this, guys. Especially Tara. <laughs> right? Especially Tara. Right? too sweet. She cares about everyone. No, she doesn't. I just... What I was looking for her costume, there was a comic where she says that... I forgot. I don't think... Uh, maybe it's Jason Todd who they're trying to hook up and said something about making love and then Starfire said something about... I don't think it involves love, something like that. So I don't think she gives a <laughs> flying about any one of these guys. She historically has been like very confused that the superheroes of Earth do not kill. She's always like, uh, "Why don't we just kill this person?" And they're like, "We don't do that here." Okay, I should I should clarify. In my head, every version of Starfire is the version of Starfire from Teen Titans. <laughs> <laughs> Does she talk like that, uh, Mr. Zubaz, in the comics? Like, backwards Yoda, Yoda-ish? No. She, she has trouble with English sometimes, like, but it's not, it's not nearly as pronounced as, as that. I mean, English is hard. Also, even. Um, when she got brought into Injustice 2, which is by all accounts a fairly dark and serious game, they got the same voice actress. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Does she I talk the same? So does she talk the same way or no? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, like, there's there's a bit more drama, and obviously the the tone is a bit more serious. Oh, um, yeah. yeah, hang on, let me. Uh... Let me find some of her quotes from the wiki. What should I start with? Uh, should I start with a heel? Yeah, we should start with a heel. Buff. Oof, ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. Alright, mm, now I don't know what to do. I'm gonna piss off Azrael. Uh, does any of us care? Yes, Batman cares. Ooh, that's a beefy hit. And Azrael, you're dead. I think you're dead. Why do I not have any end ups? I think we're still gonna die. Oof, this is bad. Did I lose you guys? Or you just went quiet? Now we're here. Okay. <laughs> we're just letting you. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I was also running through the um, Injustice Wiki. I remember the. It's most pronounced in her like arcade ladder ending, um, but yeah, she does have a line uh, sometimes uh, at the end of taking out an enemy health bar, where she'll say, "You look toasty," as they say. <laughs> Which is pretty good. <laughs> That, that's the same, uh, that's, Mortal Kombat is like the same, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, obviously. Okay, here we go. Here we go. She's, she's the same, um, that's the same voice actress as, uh, Princess Bubblegum from Adventure Time, right? Correct. Yeah. This. Siege is probably going to be rough. The more I buff, the more I pissed off Dark Side. Alright. Using them both is bad. You can only kill. Azrael. So I, I think that Blackfire will also be good against dick teams with dark side just because of her deep or her buff immunity. She does have two moves, right? That does it? Was it still, yeah. right? She's got the if they gain shield, um, then she has a seventy five percent chance to apply it. And then um 
Her third move. She uh, her her third had, it applied it to a random character. So it's not as good as Hawk or Red Robin, obviously, but it's still pretty good. All right, let's see how my team. Ho oh, this is very similar to the team that I run. Let's see if this team holds up. Oh yeah, also um, to support my uh, my head cannon. If you check her gear pieces, one of them is delicious earth beverage, and it's a jar of mustard. Wait, and she's, she says a that. Joke in the Teen Titans cartoon that she likes drinking mustard, and that's the only version of the character where this is like an established thing. It never comes up in the comics; it's just in the cartoon. But the DC Legends version has that as a gear piece. Huh. So yeah, there's a there's a couple um, a couple times that they do that. There's a couple references to like Batman the animated series, um, as opposed to like any of the stuff that's from uh, the comics too. All right, so we, we have a phone in question, Jonathan. So Terra looks good, but her passives look bad. Yes, in a way, because both of them are tied together. However, there's a legendary on her four that is good. He, uh, you're not missing anything. You have everything spot, spot on. Uh, her passive is mostly a backup plan in things, in case things go sideways. Uh, you really can't uh, put a ton personally, of debuff. Personally, I'm okay with that though, because I like the idea of the meltdown. I think it's cute, and I'm glad that they kept it. Um, but I'm glad that they don't make her entire kit revolve around like you're deliberately trying to get her debuff to all hell, because that's like a really tricky thing to play with. You know what I miss is her, they, what they should have done is her AOE should hit every freaking one. Like she doesn't care whether you're friend or foe, uh, because that would have like, been like apply like six evasion down to your out to your allies too. Oh shit, yeah, but she can <laughs> she can prevent it though, right? By having that uh, debuff immunity. But the, it's, wouldn't it be great if she can just piss off Azrael? You you you've seen me do it with uh, Raven, right? Because Raven heals and then right. proc procs uh, Azrael on your turn. But if she could have done it on, on her AOE, wouldn't that be great? Even if it's on the legendary, uh, let's say a regular AOE and then 75% to, you know, use whatever you call that AOE to everyone. That would have been cool. And then maybe from so there... you have a legendary that lets you fuck up your teammates? Why would you equip that? Well, that's what she does in the comics, right? She kind of like betrays everyone, right? Yeah, but like she betrays her team. Like she doesn't, she doesn't actually like attack them. She betrays them by like working with Deathstroke. Um, here, here is the odd thing about Meltdown, is Terra, and this is a spoiler for anybody that uh, did not read the Teen Titans in the 80s. Uh, so <laughs> I think 30 years is a sufficient time. Uh, yes, but Boston. that being said, uh, so Terra, when she has her meltdown, uh, she kills herself, is the only one that dies in her meltdown. E <laughs> she, yes. she brings down the entire like Hive headquarters on top of herself, and everybody else lives. She is the only one that dies. But Zubas. That right? would be a great move in DCL where like he's deliberately <laughs> passive ability apply zero turn doom to self. Yes, but Zubas, remember, this is DC Legends we're talking about. Right. Amazo. Amazo. Oh, does, I know. That's disease know. because computer virus. Right. And um, yeah. So it it can't make that's what you too get much from not using the VPN, boys. I do listen. I do like <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> um, I, I do like the idea of of a character that like deliberately like kills their own self, and then you can like just exploit the hell out of that with like Black Mask and Constantine and stuff like that. Like oh yeah, that would be great. <laughs> Yeah, if you have your own Lobo or something like that, yeah. Right, yeah, but like, you know, not not like full-on Lobo so that you have to like finagle it. I mean, like you literally just like, that's their move is they just, they just 
die. <laughs> I might be okay with that, honestly, because Lobo's job isn't really to die these days. That's right. just an annoying thing that he can do, but it's right. not like he's built around anymore. Does she? I mean, yeah. Tara, Tara, like, and yeah. she she didn't intentionally like want to die when she was bringing down the headquarters. It was just, she just what happened. <laughs> she just did, right? And then she came back during. Uh, oh, did she? I didn't Green know Lantern, that. Or, or during uh, yeah, the Black Blackest Night. Oh, she came back. As a zombie. Yes. You know what character has a history of repeatedly getting themselves killed in like every situation? Uh, Jericho is, is pretty good. <laughs> True. Just just add Kenny from South Park. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, yeah, Tara, Tara comes back in Blackest Night, and you... Because you said zombie, and most of them come back as zombies, and Tara did technically come back as a zombie, but she was a very smart zombie, which is, like, she got her friend to put on like a glamour basically uh so that she didn't look like she was a zombie um so they all thought that she like came back for good she even like half seduces beast boy before and they're like wait a second you're dead <laughs> huh i did not know any of that blackest night was wild uh i i didn't really care for it that much but uh it had like a lot of like just clever nods to the history of all the characters. That's pretty believable to me. It was either my fourth or fifth ex-wife who I didn't realize was a zombie until after the divorce. <laughs> okay. Did, all right. If I run into this theme in Siege, I would scream. <laughs> it's not hard because you could always... Here's the problem with any dick, dick team that you can come up with. This team would normally wreck it. This, this theme is just stupid good. I hate this theme. That's why I have it on speed dial. Yeah, God, I love Red Hood so much. He's so underrated. Is he underrated? He, I don't think he's yeah. underrated. Yeah, he really is because, okay, for some reason people, hasn't he been brought down to A tier now? What? He's S tier. What are you talking about? Well, wasn't he brought down to A tier on the last tier list? No. I don't think so. I remember so. people were trying to do it. I thought that went through. Did mm, it not? Oh, yes. He yes. is A tier. What? Yeah, he's A tier. According yeah. to a certain group of individuals. Yeah, he got demoted. <laughs> he did, he did um, get um, demoted. The, the reason why he got demoted is like, oh, he's easy to deal with on defense. Did I say that? Same I as, hope not. Yeah, same as Deadshot Hired Gun. But like Deadshot Hired Gun was still considered S tier for like basically forever until now where it's been power crap. No, the the reason I I would bump down uh Deadshot is because most of the good dudes don't need him to one hit KO. Yeah. Yeah, that too. That's a waste of a space or spot. But yeah, Red, Red Hood is, in my opinion, still S tier. I don't understand why he was demoted. I mean, there could be a case for quite a few of the students on the A tier. It's just that the S tier now is kind of exclusive. Uh, I I debated whether Wonder Girl should go down, but I think this month her stock is going to rise. Like, here's the thing, okay? I like Dark Side, and I think that Dark Side is fun, but Red Hood, to me, is like undoubtedly better. Oh, I disagree with that. I, I, I kind of disagree too, because Red Hood needs someone to kill. Darkseid is the... Yeah, but the thing is with Darkseid is that he's pretty slow. And his team leader ability, it's good. And it, I mean, it enables some characters more than others, but it's... It doesn't let you single-handedly win an entire match the way Jason oh, look, Blade does. Look at it's that. just not the same. Look at that freaking... There you go. It's... Wow. <laughs> wow. That's that dark a... side at work right there. <laughs> and did you just see her wreck? Oh my god, Dara. Good job. Do not bleed Dara. <laughs> I want to see that again. I 
don't want to see that again. Yeah, so that's why Meltdown isn't terrible. It's not. It's it's amazing. Because it just makes you think twice before you try to pull that shit on her. Because you're like, ah, uh, really? Uh, is it worth? It. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Is that enough? Yeah, it should be enough. Yeah, of course it will be. Uh, that's like nine debuffs. I wish I could stun her just to prove that it, she's gonna shake it off. Can I get another turn before she does? How do I? How do I do that? Why would she? Why would she shake off her ton or her stun because of the uh, meltdown? Yeah. Yeah, she purges all debuffs from herself. Interesting. She should. She should. But I can't prove it. I need, I have to prove it. God damn it. God damn it, Darks. <laughs> Holy shit. Why did she hit twice? Oh, that's her regular turn move. Okay. She just hit her, she did her meltdown, did her basic. And the dark cycle without a basic. Yep. No, I How are you feeling about your earlier assessment that Red Hood was better than Dark Knight? <laughs> no, I, I, I still stand by that 100%. There's, there have been so many times in my life where I've been playing this game and I've gone, oh shit, how am I going to get around this team? And I go, Red Hood, and then, like, you know, Red Hood Argus or something. I, I have not once uh, had a match where I have felt confident that Dark Side is the way to three star counter pick something. It's not happened to me. He's a pain on defense, but there's never been a time where I've gone, I know that if I slot Dark Side into this lead right now, I will 100% win this entire match. Like, he's just not like that. He doesn't do that. Uh, if you're facing enough greens, then yes. He's, he's such a dick to greens. I mean, yeah, true. He's tanky. I'm, again, I want to clarify, I'm not saying Dark Side isn't good. Dark Side's very, very good. You just think he's red. Just, he doesn't have that, like hardcore insane counter pick like clutch factor let's see if i can change your mind oh god dang it what's it that would kill her if you stunned <laughs> I have to kill Darkseid because she he's an asshole. Alright, so ooh, okay. Let's I maybe. Maybe. She, but she might die. She won't have enough debuffs to trigger it though. No, Terra could give it to her, but she might die. Holy shit. This gives Tell me again how good Darkseid is. <laughs> he just got fucking one shot, dude. Will she die? Uh, I don't know. From now, she definitely would. Yeah. Darkseid doesn't guarantee a steamroll in that same way. Oh, she said, they told you she's gonna die. All right, let's team roll through a few more. Um, see how good they are. All right, I'm gonna use this team because this I want to use this opportunity to decide whether this team is worth reverting and if it can beat most. Because she uh, she ticks a lot of check boxes for me. Evasion check. Um, stun teams check. Um, what else? Revivers, check. Alright, this, alright, let's see. This is an RB2 Arcus. No crit. Not quite. Almost there. Oh, yeah, if, if you're trying to argue with me about whether Dark Side slaps, I know Dark Side slaps. It's okay. I have him oh, gear 11, damn. I use him. I have fun using him. I just, Why do you hate him like M4 hates Aquaman? Or I just, Aqualad? I do I've, not hate <laughs> I've never been in a situation where I'm like in a tricky match and I'm like, 
dark side is the answer here. Like, it's just never happened, you know? All right, so Crushburger is asking me if I could, I would ever go work finest in anything other than Siege. Uh, break is impossible, showdown maybe, but it, I can't do 20,000 points and that's just a lot of time that I can't and I don't have. All right, so far this team is pretty damn good. And only Varda is revert. Yeah, Josh, let's see. Uh, oh, I wish he's here so we can trash talk Josh. Uh, I'm gonna say this. Josh, I think it's a one and done. Somebody clip it. You calling him a one pump chunk? <laughs> I probably won't, but at the same thought, yeah. Crush, do not. If I get a one bit uh, anonymous contribution, then you don't say her name thrice. So that's all I'm going to say. She might make a comeback. I, would this team work on auto? Maybe it would. Let's see. Yes, definitely. <laughs> oh my god, Dark Side makes Azrael ridiculous. All right. So the question now is, do I want to rebirth Terra? Is she worth it? I think she is. She replaces three tunes for me. She's not a dick, but she is a good. All right. Now, this is a good test. Wonder Girl and. Oh my God. I think this is going to happen. We're going to see a resurgence of Harley and Wonder Girls around. Not enough to hit. Okay, but uh, this is enough to kill. Oh, dang it. Can I do this? No, not enough to kill. Oh, but Is your opinion on whether you will rebirth her? It, what if they change so that her debuff immunity goes before the enemies no, that would just make her even better doesn't it all right so, yeah okay. tell me again how great dog side is <laughs> <laughs> he is l5 facing an rb4 harley okay and i i misplayed it I yeah but be honest if he used some form of Red Hood, Red Robin, Brainiac team here, you definitely would have won. <laughs> All right. But isn't that more about Red Robin than... Like, I get, like, the whole Red Hood, Red Robin thing, but he, Red Hood, I think, loses a lot when he, when he doesn't have Red Robin. He needs to um, kill, basically. Yeah, no, he just needs to get a kill. He just needs someone right. on his team to get any kill. So it doesn't have to be Red Robin. It can be Black Flash. It can be any excellent character. All right. So here is your you're, you're a slave to um, RNG here. I, I would have gone with uh, someone with some kind of really good can't miss move. But yeah, you'll be fine. I'd like Josh used to say, just RNG harder. And you don't have to worry about Harley retaliating because gain your invis. I hate Argus. Uh, yeah. Easy. And then three on Harley. Yep. But this team is just... This team is just stupid good. I, I hate this team. See, this is what I'm saying. Like, you, you take this and you know you're gonna win. Most of the time, yes. Except for the Bla uh, Martian Manhunter Black Flash teams, you're you're not fast enough. Yeah, yeah, but Dark Side's not fast enough for those either. So, oh, uh, all right. Let me show you what I do with. Oh, I disagree. Yeah, Dark Dark Side is really good against those teams because once the buffs start coming in, then he gets turn meter, and it actually works out pretty well. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to deal with this crap. 
Uh, I don't know, that kind of like, let the crazy turn meter team walk all over you and pray that you survive. I don't know, I've never been a fan of that kind of strat. I mean, it works pretty well with Darkseid because he gets, uh, he gets all those stamina ups too. I definitely haven't had a problem with, with that. Is this yeah, gonna I mean, work? Let's see. I think it's gonna oh, work. Oh yeah, Shiva as well. You have Shiva. All right, I haven't used her. Really to... Is this enough? She gains four. She get she gets five. Let's see if it works. Dang it! <laughs> Alman would have. <laughs> That ain't gonna work, Darkus. That ain't gonna work. Alright. Oof, nice. That ain't gonna work either. Bard is so damn good. Yeah, right now I'm mostly seeing Balda going off. I feel like anyone could be in the lead slot right now, and this team would still be doing what it's doing. You know what I mean? But he's but he's also overhealing and gaming, gaining stamina ups. Like he's oh, yeah, pretty no. unkillable right now. No, he's he's good. Look at <laughs> look at Harley is bouncing off. That she oh, didn't even all right, take him all right, out of all right, overheal. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I I I I see SBO's point. All right, so let's try this again using red. Oh my God, you're just gonna prove it that it's. God dang it. <laughs> He's... Dang it. Yeah, I feel like you could... Yeah, sure. Yes, this, this, yeah, this would work. And then RNG is going to work in my favor and SPO is going to say, See, I told you. <laughs> Look at this. Good. <laughs> okay, perfect. She missed. All right, perfect. Let's see how well this goes. Oh look, Barda's doing Barda things. <laughs> yes, she does. Oh, and uh, use Jason's basic on Harley. Okay, I am going to honor that request. Come on, do that. Alright, she didn't do that thing. See, it resets that turn meter for some reason. <laughs> Why? I don't know. <laughs> she... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Did you not know that? <laughs> it's not supposed it's not supposed to do that. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. So you can see. <laughs> that Did you know that, Mr. Zuvas? I did not. Okay. Yeah, if you go against an evasion character and you use front of his basic, he resets their turn meter. No, he doesn't steal buffs, he doesn't put buff in the Okay, this resets is resets their turn meter. All right, please don't die, Harley. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. There's hope. There's hope. There's hope. No, she's gonna die. How do I miss? How do I freaking miss? She's she's dead. Just just accept it. Red Hood's too good. You you literally can't lose. No, that's not true. It's impossible. Im th that's impulse. That's impulse territory. Okay. <laughs> All right. Holy shit! We're almost three hours into this, and we're having too much. Oh my god! It's gone five a.m. <laughs> Do you have? Uh, there's no memorial for you, right? What's? Do you have school or whatever tomorrow? Hope not. Uh no, it's half term. What is it? Half term. So I oh, okay, yeah, but, okay. I did. So now RNG works in my favor. So that time it didn't do anything to the turn meter, right? I, I well, she did. died. But yeah, then Harley bled out anyway. Because even though Jason's basic missed, um, she bleeds apply no matter what. Yes, because uh, so it's yeah, can't guaranteed miss. six right. bleeds that. So she bled out, which then meant that you stole all of their buffs and then got guaranteed turns and you would have wiped them. 
Okay, I'm gonna remove. Sh I'm gonna remove so Shiva right now to not win this match. Yes, I <laughs> am. <laughs> I am. That is that part is true. <laughs> All right, I'm going to remove Shiva. Just just to remove that. Like speed. I made I made my point before. I was like I'm pretty sure this team would work well no matter who you put in lead. So you put in Jason. Now it's like unbeatable. <laughs> All right, here we go. I, I just want to see that interaction with. Uh... Oh, does it work that she has? Uh... What you call that? Community? Yeah, would it work, SPL? Um, yeah, I, I think it would still work. Okay, I'm going to use this so it doesn't hurt. Use the basic. Oh, I wanted to miss. All right, so now. Use her too. Huh? Yeah, just just so, but she hit anyway. Yeah, all right so all right basic. okay so she has about roughly 40 percent turn meter all right let's do I it i don't think it affects her i think it affects everyone else okay she got her turn. okay no it didn't go that time but that's because he hit i think yeah he no hit, he hit. did he hit yeah or at least some of them did i don't know it's weird it's clearly a bug and it's not supposed okay to. all right <laughs> does it, it only sometimes. work is it does he have to be leader exactly what causes it does he have to be leader to for it to work or no um i think so oh. i never use him outside of lead because why would i okay so all right dang it okay so let's do this uh, because you could use dark side as leader and red hood off lead, yeah. and then you can do his base tick twice <laughs> Uh, let's see. Am I fast enough to do this? Let's see. I think one way will to find be it. if you take your own black flash and use uses two. Or oh, impulse, yeah. Is Red Bug like Red Hood, is he like the most bugged character of all time? Probably. <laughs> he, he might be the yes, yes. clayface. Is like still coming up with new bugs, like and and whenever a new character comes in that has something involving death, like Red Hood immediately bugs it. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, God damn it, miss. He freaking hit. Yep. I. No, but look, he reset everything. Yeah, look, he just reset. reset. I've been using this for years. I thought everyone knew. <laughs> what? All right, all right. I'm gonna give you this strike from the record. <laughs> what the? F all right. I have no explanation for that. Neither do I. I have had no explanation ever since I finally gave him up. Which, by the way, you know how I said I didn't like know how to get PvP characters back when Brainiac came out? Same thing for Red Hood. I didn't actually get to gear him up until his rework. That was when I finally got enough chance of him. And I also think I might have bought him in the store because I wanted him that bad. Um, so yeah, I finally geared up my Red Hood back when he got his rework. Which, when was that? I think it was the same i think it was november it was, I think it yeah was no, november connor. december i think it was when connor and rose came out it was that november i this, think this is insane all right good but yeah so anyway that was that was when i geared him up and ever since then so ever since the rework i've been using that this is crazy all right here we go I here we go that one match against harley and i was like okay all right, here we go. Let's see if we can figure it out. All right, one, one X. All right, everyone is about to go. Um. Okay, I didn't go off that time. I think his miss, yeah miss. his his first it. attack needs to miss. I think that's how it works. It did. The first one missed. Oh, did it? Then why the hell did yeah. they not get reset? I don't know. I think it might be more specific than that. Okay. But I don't know. This needs a all, lot more. All testing. I know is that it happens like consistently enough that you can use it to your advantage. Does Barda's her did they just give her the exact same animation as Terra? To do what? No, no. When no. when when Bard's, she like pounds the Bard's, ground and the Barda's is like a stomp thing. 
Okay. It's a bit different. All right. We, but yeah, they are kind of similar. All right, we need to piss Harley off to get her to evade more. Come on, evade Harley. Dang it. is gonna die from bleeds oh wait no red hood gonna go first okay all right let's see all right this game is excruciatingly slow <laughs> i don't understand how people can play like this <laughs> Neither do I. all right let's no, go, go right. for it she reset he reset her turn either oh because Miss. he's probably gonna do Miss. Oh. it Okay, so that time two of them missed. But then she died, oh. though. Oh, so. no, she actually died. Oh, okay. All right, this... this... Shit, I don't know, man. Look, I don't know, I don't know either. I've got, this... it to, I've got it to happen twice on camera, so... Yeah, all right. So this is not a Red Hood stream. <laughs> all right, so I think we've showcased the new tunes enough. All right, so let's do a recap. Um, Starfire, Pew Pew, AoE, good damage. Terra, good replacement for Hal and Stefan Wolf. And Offly, that makes her wonderful. Decent damage and good backup with her passives. Might surprise someone if they're not careful. But bottom line, both tunes are at least a B tier at this point. I would bet they would be at least A tier when the month is over. Um, thoughts, guys? Do you have anything else to add? No. <laughs> <laughs> and then it pretty S much sums it up. Uh, I have to go file some bug reports about uh, Red Hood. Uh, I'll no, be back in a little bit. Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm going to test this some more because this is interesting piece of information yeah i want to at least can we try to figure out how it works before we tell it <laughs> yes i i would do that uh maybe there's a stream in between today and when siege starts so well, let's, let's see oh but raids is gonna happen so i don't know if that i can do that but definitely i'm gonna start streaming once again once siege starts it's probably on sunday but anyway, thanks again for my two guests, surprise and surprise guest and one that it surprised even me. A pleasant surprise though, mind you. But thanks again for making the stream lively. Too lively, that's almost three hours and I didn't even you notice. You're more welcome, my friend. <laughs> Man, it's not every day you're such a good surprise guest, you surprise the host. Yes. <laughs> Yes, and I hope people learned something new today from the two new reworks in Red Hood. And nobody tell Tootie because he's going to tattle on us. All right. And anyway, <laughs> thanks guys for joining us for almost three hours. This feels like a Josh stream. Right. It is. <laughs> all right. Good night, guys. And Good I'll night. see you all when Siege starts. All right. Empire out. Bye-bye. Right.